Welcome back guys, welcome to the channel, my name is Unpredictable. In this video, I'll be showing you the top 10 Cydia tweaks, completely free, that you can download on your iPhone device. If you want to install them, there will be links down below in the description on how to do it. Uh, I've made multiple videos about this, so anyways, I hope you enjoy, let's get this video started. Leave a like, subscribe, and see you soon. So guys, if you remember, what I did the last video was, basically if a video gets over 200 likes in the next 24 hours, I'll be doing a giveaway, iTunes giveaway. And basically, you guys smashed the like button, it's at like nearly 400 right now, and guys, you're killing it. So basically what I've done, I've basically I've put a code throughout this video, it either could be at the beginning, the middle, the end of this video, it's somewhere in this video. So a test like this, you will get a text on the screen and you should find a code. So what you're gonna have to do is go inside the App Store or iTunes and redeem it yourself. If you want, please leave a comment down below. If you haven't, then better luck next time because there will be more coming in tomorrow's video, I believe. So best of luck and enjoy the video. So make sure to subscribe to my channel it's right there. So once it goes up, that means somebody to subscribe to me. So let's get to so let's get 14,000 subscribers, guys. It means so much. And so the first week is called pencil charger. Basically, what it does if you're on like an iPad and you put the pencil down on the new ones, it gets a little charging symbol. Basically, basically this week allows you to do the same animation wise. So if I plug my charger in on my phone, you should see like a nice little animation over here. So as you saw, that looks really cool. It's called Pencil Charger. It's free to download down below in the description. So the next tweak I have for you guys is called Lock Glyph. Basically what it does, if you lock your device, you're gonna get this little symbol over here. It's like a fingerprint. So basically if you touch it, it scans your finger and it just unlocks like that. Obviously you have got to click it just because as you can see, it does unlock, but that's what it does. It basically if you touch it slightly, it gives this little animation. If you get the passable code wrong, it vibrates, and then it just unlocks. So there is settings. So there is a settings for this. However, settings doesn't seem to be working. So don't be commenting down below if there's any issues with this. Okay. So the next week I have for guys is called Spring Plus. Basically, what it does is it allows you to like customize pretty much everything. Go into like lock screen settings. Disable wake for power connected. Press uh, like you can hide certain things. Hide page dots. Disable camera. You can do so many things over here. You can go to Springboard as well, um, state status bar, all these good stuff, guys. App switcher system. <laughs> I'm not going to go through all of them, but basically, guys, you can mess about with this and change your device as much as you want. So, this is called Spring Plus. It's going to be linked down below in the description as to every other tweak. Okay, guys. So the next tweak is called Boulders. Basically, what it does, it having from like a big annoying folder. It just changes it to something nice. As you can see, it got, kind of removes everything and it puts it in one big loop of like blur. So I really like this. As you can see, same in here. There's an issue with this because it kind of says apps right in the left corner, top, um, when it should be like below the folders. It's strange, but it does work, guys. So it does look kind of cool though. It gives a nice little look to your I do iPhone device. So for the next week, I feel like this is very like simple, but I just love it so much. Basically, what happens if you like swipe um, on your status bar, it just removes it completely. So as you can see, it just it's gone, and then to get it back up if you want a time, and then just swipe it back to the right, and it's over here. So of course, there's settings about it. So you go to swipe to hide. You can swipe to hide the dock. Um, and status bar, so you must enable it before this works because it just won't work. Um, I tried to get this working, but it wouldn't work for me. But anyways, right. So the next week is called Artsy. Um, so basically, what it does, if you ha play on Spotify or like any music, basically, and then let's just choose a song. We'll do this one. As you can see, I'm gonna move this real quick before I get copyright. Basically, what it does, yeah, it picks out the album picture and that puts it over here also if you do lock your device it should change your wallpaper to that certain song so let's go back up and change the song so as you can see guys the pic the album picture is right there and if i do lock my device it changes everything so i really like this tweak it's really cool you can pause it and as you can see it just looks really cool obviously this will get fixed later on but that's really cool. So of course, the next week is called Five Column. As you can see, it does look a bit odd because I'm not used to it and I'm pretty sure you are not. Basically what it does, 
instead of having like four icons on each row, it basically gives you five. So it just kind of makes your iPhone look more full in a way. So if we go, go over to this one, if I can add certain more applications on one page instead of having to move over to the other one. And if you have lots of applications, you can fit them all in one page. So as you can see, there's one, two, three, four, five, and it works really cool. So I can, if I wanted to, I can get Spotify and drag it all the way to the here and then fill it up. So this is called a five column. And the next week basically I'm going to go and jump in at the same time, it's called Bounce. Basically what Bounce does, uh, when you open an app, it gives us nice big bounce. As you can see, if you close it, open it up, at Twitter, Bounce. And it's like, it's kind of cool, it may get a bit annoying for you guys. So if you do fancy and you're looking for something new, I guess this is a tweak for you. Clear. And the next week is called Clear Dock. As you can see on my dock, there's nothing going on behind it. There's no like, there's no like grey... Oh, there's no like black little images. I can't really describe it, but basically it's a clear dock. I'm pretty sure you know what I'm on about. Um, so that's clear dock. It just kind of makes it nice, more minimalistic. And the next tweak is called double tap to unlock, double tap to lock your device. So basically, if I double tap anywhere, just like so, it locks my device. So I don't even need to be pressing this button over here. I can just set my phone down, double tap, and it's locked. And guys, this tweak is really cool. So, so guys, I hope you've been enjoying my video. Every link is going to be down below in the description for these tweaks.